Sadly, we need to start with some breaking news and a heartbreaking update. The body of a six-year-old boy has been found after he fell off a dock and into the Kankakee River. All this happening west of I-57 tonight near the Kankakee Valley Boat Club. NBC5's Evrod Kasimi spoke with the emergency crews who spent hours tonight searching for the child. I can't imagine what the family's going through right now, yeah. and I hope they never experience that. It was a sad ending to a search in Kankakee after a six-year-old boy fell into the Kankakee River. Just after 3 Tuesday, first responders were called here after reports that a boy had fallen into the water chasing after a ball. The ball goes in the water. He tries to retrieve the ball. Brothers and sisters were playing on the dock nearby, uh, and the boy had uh, accidentally fell in, appeared, and... Uh, Unfortunately, he couldn't swim. Video from Sky 5 shows police and fire crews searching for the child's body. They worked for more than two hours before he was recovered from the water, lifeless. The child's mother was there when her son's body was found. Her mother was very distraught. She was crying. She just couldn't believe what happened. It's a tragic event. Um, anytime you lose a loss of life, it's uh, very tragic. But when it's a young victim, somebody under the age of 18 in this particular situation, six years old, uh, it, it hits the heart even harder. It was difficult for Mayor Curtis and the police and fire chief to witness a mother realize her child is gone. How are you guys doing right now? It's tough. Do you have children? Any of you? We all do. I ask everybody to keep her in her prayers along with the rest of her family. A number of people have shown up to the water's edge, shaken up after learning what happened here. Police have not released that little boy's identity. This is being considered a tragic accident. In Kankakee, Evrod Kasimi, NBC5 News. Absolutely awful. Our thanks to Evrod.